Finally got it. Take what we get. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to windy.com. This is Chris speaking, C. Fernald. What we're going to do here is I got the cameras hooked up. I, ha I haven't spent a lot of time on this, so this is like a first time I'm recording it. And um, you can see right here the wind. Okay, you could also see when you go to a location. Let's go over here, this location. And you'll be able to see all this. You look just like at the weather. The reason I'm showing you this is not so much for hunting the skies, but it's pretty cool. Um, is that, let's say you live in, let me see if I can turn this back into a map. If I lose you guys, you know, I'll be back. But no, right, right through here, you got like San Diego to LA. I'm right in this area and you can see 55 minutes ago, nice, nice weather. So if you're going traveling in the United States, you might want to use this tool. I think you can get a download for your phone, but look at this mess over here. Okay, so no matter what the Weather Channel is telling you, you look at this thing, you can click on here, um, rain and thunder, and it will change it. The Shreveport, look at this rain right here, thunder, 78 degrees, there's a, look at that wind. There's a way you can do the wind speed and um, so I'm saying, uh, you can go, okay, new snow. Where's all the new snow at? And all along you have these cameras and you guys could just uh, go check where you're going. Like if you're going to Kentucky, go check it out. Go see what the weather's like for real. I mean, yeah, listen to the weather channel, but when I mean, you go on one of these cameras, You have a choice of 30 days, 12 months, lifetime, 24 hours. 24 hours. And it's going to give you a fast time lapse. Okay. And if you want to go to Des Moines City, let's see, you can change it right in the stream. Do the same thing. You Sky Hunters will have a field day with this. Yeah, and why not? Okay, you can see what's going on. Oh, wait, what was that? See, and you can go what don't skip by me you have to go real slow this thing might be taking pictures every 20 minutes so there you go i'll show you how i find cameras playing around with this thing for a while trying to learn it so let me see where i can go let's go to British Columbia has road cameras. Look at that guy. Look at that, people. Now we go all the way up to Dawn City. Anchorage, Alaska has cameras. And you can go up here, and sometimes you're going to catch a good sky. Or a purple snow. Or something. You don't know. These are not censored, I don't think, as hard. But if you have suspicion, what I would do is just stop and watch the sky go down for 24 hours. Watch the tide come in. Watch the tide go out. Anyways. Where are we at over here? We are in Alaska. These cams are worldwide. Let's see, yep. Wow, we're in Kosmosi. I can't say that on Amor South. This is what it looks like if you've never been there. So, interesting. You might be interested in seeing what's going on in South Korea. Okay, let's do it. So I'm just showing you guys a way to experience the world without leaving your couch that are disabled. And the ones that watch the skies, you never know what you might find. Life's like a box of chocolates, I call it. 
Remember old Farris told us, sometimes you get a nut. Anyways, you know me guys. Let's go to Pakistan. Well, let's go to... Now you don't, this is a good, good place right here, this, the way the sky is situated. But I want to see what's happened here for 24 hours. Now if I catch something, the way I am, the way I hunt skies, if I catch something I'm suspicious about, I'll stop. Okay, now let's go to a 30, let's go to 30 days of what the sky looked like. Now let's say you find something, you can go for 30 days, see if it comes back. If it's there the next day or not. It could just be a phenomenon. That's real fast. Anyways, you can play with them. You can go worldwide. Oh, uh, let me see. Let's go to somewhere like Ukraine. Let's say Ukraine. Where am I, guys? Okay, Georgia. Yeah, look at those blacked out. Romania. Clouds, like I see here, clouds, clouds, clouds. Oh, my phone is just going berserk. Oh, look at that cam. Let's watch it super fast. Click it. I can save it. Now I save everything to my desktop at first. Let's see, you could sky hunt. A little bar there. Look how long that picture's staying up. That was sunset. I can save it that way. Anyways, I can't, you can't save it that way. You have to actually, like what I would do, I'll just show you guys. I have a little free tool when I'm in a hurry. It's called Bandicam. Okay. Cam pops up, do the full page, uh, or I could just crop it right there. This is how I get some of my pictures real quick. I'm having a hard time getting it real quick. Once I get the picture, okay, I take a snapshot of it. Okay, so if there's any more like that one, I'll take a snapshot. Not a lot of quality on this. Take a snapshot of that. You guys seeing me? Maybe not. Uh, anyways, that's how I get some quick shots. Um, if you guys are still there, I'm here. I didn't know if you saw that, but anyways, we we'll go down to Miami, check it out. Oh, nice sky cam. Go for it. You know, you might see something you really like. Wait a minute. What was that? That's something. 21 hours ago, coming up in Miami. 20 hours ago. I see. West Coast. Anyways, guys. 
I think my eyes are trained to catch a few things. If you guys could see this. I thought these clouds were very interesting right here. Um, very clear. Good picture. 20 hours ago. Well, anyways, that's all for now. Take you back to the weather. So this way, guys, you can compare your weather. You know what I'm saying? Uh, let's go back to the wind factor here. There's your wind. Um, how do you do the winds? Anyways, I'll learn how to do this more. Um, go out here to Hawaii, I think. Say goodbye. Have a good night, guys.